Hi, in this video I'll be showing you how you can customize your ducting layers in MetQ with specific color overrides. Here I've got the MetQ ribbon displayed and as you can see here's our main ducting module here. We've got elbows, T's, offsets, and so forth. I'm working in a application called AbbeyCAD which is our AutoCAD alternative which ships with our MetQ engineering tools plus many other tools as well included. I'll be working in 3D today so I'll go to my 3D view here then I'll be going into the HVAC duct module here. Over here I've got my rectangular shape checked and I'm using a 12 by 6 dimension here. I'll come down to my options menu and I'll make sure that my 3D is turned on here and then I'll go into my layers option here. Here is where I can start to do some customizations. So if you click this edit button and we will choose the supply from the list, we'll choose layer color override and then give this a color blue and we'll select OK and then OK. And we'll do one more. Let's do the return We'll choose the layer override here and then the color magenta for this one. And then we'll choose OK. Now it's just a matter of drawing the duct in. So we'll choose draw and we'll just we'll left click for our starting point. We'll make sure our ortho mode is turned on, which it is. If it's not, press the F8 key to make the line straight and then we'll zoom up and we'll draw a line in here at five feet and then we'll exit and then we'll do a elbow we'll pick it from this point here we'll choose draw and we need to snap to this node right here you can kind of see it there type in NOD to snap to it we'll point to the upstream direction here then we'll just rotate the duct in like this. Now let's draw a return. So let's go back into the duct utility again. Choose the layer option. And here we need to specify that we want to be drawing on the turn layer. So we choose OK. We choose draw. And we'll just put this one right beside it. We'll draw this one in at five feet and exit and then we'll draw an offset on this one. Here's our width and height here but over here we can specify the offset itself. We'll just put the length in at 24. Now this is a width direction. We'll just set that at zero our height will be 8 inches and we'll choose draw and again we need to force snap the nodes we'll type in NOD and then point it in the upstream direction then we'll enter to exit if we want we could shade these pieces in using the shade command and now let's have a quick look at the layers. So if we type in LA for layers, you can see that it has put a prefix in front of all the return layers here and a prefix here for the supply layers. So I hope this video has helped. Feel free to reach us at 888-271-7121 and we'll see you in the next video.